All right, this is Gista, aka the Boss, aka One Eye Willie Slinger Kuda Smasher. Uh, I am with Riker, indeed, probably one of the best co-casters to ever exist. We are there casting TSL Week One, Game One right now. Uh, unwanted versus We Nuke and Run. Right now, the lobby is up. Uh, Everybody is ready to go at it, and uh, hopefully, we uh, we bring a good. A good game to y'all right quick. Uh, you got me, you got Riker. Um, we're going to help you learn this star battle thing uh, for, for you youngins out there. And uh, for, for everybody else, uh, we're here to support your need for, for combat. And uh, let's just, let's go to Riker right quick. Riker, um, what do you think we're going to see out of this match in terms of strategies or... Or how you think the uh, the match will just go in general? Well, I haven't played Unwanted very much lately, but you can run is known for their muscle comps, so it wouldn't be too surprised to see a muscle comp from him right off the bat. It'd be interesting to see how Unwanted will play against that. So if you're one of our uh, one of our Unwanted fans out there, uh, you know they got you know a lot of support. Um, what do you want to see out of Unwanted to overcome that muscle comp tendency that you see out of We Nuke and Run nowadays? Uh, you probably want to see a lot of launchings going on, the pushing back. Definitely want to get some AoE. If they go more of a kite build, they're just going to stay out of the range of the uh, Destros and they'll be fine. But when you can Run, they make that pretty difficult to jump on top of you right away. But it'll be interesting to see what I want to go is right off the bat. Uh, while these guys are BSing, I'm going to go grab a, a, a fruit juice, if you will, from my refrigerator. So now don't let them start if this dude magically gets back like one second after I AFK. Alright. Just a uh, FYI for young bucks. Fruit juice, um, we're not talking about fruit juice. We're talking about this, uh, this Spaten Oktoberfest. Oh, Premium. it looks like he may have came back, so he might be ready. Alright, and we are getting ready to go. I got the beers, we got the games, we got the players. Everybody, let's enjoy. I go loading screen. Fighting. Alright, so we are off. We've got red team is going to be we nuke and run for this game. Uh, looks like they've come out with double carrier, double guardian, levy, destro. Unwanted has busted out double guardian. Uh, looks like a single carrier, overlord, raven, and Leviathan. Alright, so at, at first look at these compositions we have here, um, as you can see, Nut Butter uh, go off towards what looks like uh, would be some kind of flanking maneuver. Yeah, um, what he's going to actually do is he's going to push this levy back, and then you see the double carriers here in the middle of 6 in. He's going to push, get on one of the top of these guards. There he goes. Now, what they're going to do is they're going to launch on one of the guards that he gets on and hopefully get a kill here. Alright, so there you see it. Flanking maneuver. 
Um, they've got, you know, full uh, full attack on the guard. I think we're looking at, yeah, Darth Herb right here. Uh, looks like he's looks like he's getting back with plenty of time, but uh, big trouble for Alpha. Uh, he does not look like he's gonna make it. Uh, they're gonna ride it all the way in and kill him, huh? Oh, he might have made it. Look at that. All right, so Alpha is gonna make that, sitting at about two two. Uh, 280 HP by the time he hits the base. Um, how would you grade that that reaction by unwanted? I thought that uh, that butter probably just did more on one target. He switched there at the end. They probably could have got him. Um, but overall, I mean, they both lived and it worked out quite well. The Overlord and Raven, they definitely could have an advantage in late game with this comp. All right, so we see the. Um we see the flanking maneuver. Um, it gets a it gets a push, um, gets that happening. But right now we're looking about even farm, you know, about 20, 30 more for uh, for the we nuke and run guys right now. Uh, to be expected, got that early push. Uh, what's your strategy if you're uh, if you're on one and now? What do you what do you what are you gonna tech to? What are you looking What are you looking to do to, to bust this game well, out? Well, early game since they have. Nothing really for the Raven to deny. The Raven just gonna be focused on keeping the butter shields down. By keeping the shields down, the Honey Badger will play him, pretty much make him a non-factor in the early game. Late game with the PDDs, D Matrix, uh, they should have a good chance of winning this game. The only thing that's really giving problems is the ends. But you will see probably both levies get acid spray to counter that. And uh oh, looks like Alpha's in trouble here. Oh, Alpha again, you know. On his bike right now, getting out of there. Uh, some covering going on right there. Looks like he's gonna make it back okay. Um, do you get a little bit antsy if you're a guy in a guardian? You you get a couple a couple moments like that where it looks like people are player hating on you a little harder than normal or what? Yeah, these guards. When you're a guardian at 1.4 speed, you need to be aware of where that death row is and not get caught. Caught because once he jumps on top of you, he won't let go. All right, now we Especially see low Alpha sitting at 1.5 right now, Darth Herb at 1.4. Um, you had 4-3 out of the single carrier over here, and then 6-1 on the other side, um, as is the standard around these parts. Uh, these Guardians on We Nuke and Run side both came out with spines, and, uh, you know, levies do the levy thing. Right now, We Nuke and Run has Nut Butter inside the base. Looks like he's going to take... Uh, oh, he's gonna heal up a little bit. Maybe take a little wide angle. Uh, potentially get this get this warp trick. If there's some kind of push, if unwanted can manage a push, uh, then they're you know potentially gonna set them up for for a warp trick. But uh, we really don't see a lot of map domination from unwanted right now. Um, is that to be expected with these compositions? At this time, because. Yeah, um get the muscle comp a lot more on new can run side, so they're going to be pushing them a little harder with the two supports on Unwanted, but in the late game, you start to see that shift a little bit. Don't be surprised if you see Unwanted down far in most of the game, that's to be expected. But late game, they should have the advantage with the Overlord Raven. Okay, now I do not, uh, as you can see, Nut Butter yeah. is way up here, um, so everybody Very knows trouble. what that means. Uh, is this reaction gonna be fast enough by unwanted? I don't know. Oh, they're in trouble. It's like. So we're gonna see. Uh, well, we're gonna see the the warp trick. You know, this is star battle one on one right here, guys. Um, I'm probably like the worst star battle player ever, and I, you know, this is this is stuff that even I would do. This is like the basics, and uh, you're gonna see a warp trick executed. Uh, probably pretty nice right here. Um, looks like the target's gonna be Honey Badger and the Overlord. Um, potentially gonna lose more than one guy on this though, because yeah, Unwanted is good. is very far out from their base. All right, Honey Badger goes down to Laptop Panda, and uh, looks like we're gonna lose Darth Herb right here. Um, he's gonna go down if they can. Yep, zero HP is death, and then bam, you've got the other Guardian Alpha. He's gonna die as well. Uh, We'll see if Unwanted uh, decides to continue it on as my computer slows down the game. G 
you, uh, you know, you, is there a strategy need, right uh, now for Unwanted or what? It, it's pretty much GG at this point. They need, you need to be more aware of what's going on. Dash went back pretty early and hadn't been in a while. Should have been aware of a warp trick there. Stayed way too long, obviously. Yeah, it's, yeah, that was, uh, that's tough. It's, they, they got it's the, uh, the reaction right. Uh, on that initial flanking maneuver, uh, unfortunately, uh, didn't didn't uh, give enough respect to the warp trick uh, capability there, uh, and you're gonna, I mean, that's gonna hurt you. No other way to to really put that. So, and there we go. Reborn Captain Firm One is gonna GG this one out. Uh, we've got a a win for the We Nuke and Run guys uh, in this first game. Now, keep in mind, people, this is not really best of three this is three games being played uh, in the week or whatever they're all adding up towards a, a season total um, I know there was some confusion about that with guys but that's what the deal is so there you have it uh, round one goes to we nuke and run